you install the Assetto Corsa box cam mod, you load up Assetto Corsa, turn on your box cam, and you get this. You are probably on this video because your box cam is blurry, and this is the tutorial for you. Right now, I'm going to show how my box cam is blurry. So I press F3 until I get box cam right over here. Then I go to my apps, stereo box cam, and activate. You can see how my car is like very blurry. And that's not good. If you want your car to look good, it shouldn't look blurry. And I am here to help you fix it. Fixing it is actually very easy. So here's the fix you've been waiting for. All you have to do is just open your box cam without going into the box cam view using F3. Just open your apps and press activate. And that's it. Your car isn't blurry. And it's all good. You can also do it from any view. Let's say I, I'm in first person, right? I can activate it. Boom. It's not blurry at all. Yeah, that was much more simple than you probably thought it would be. Another thing I noticed is that you don't actually have to drag the track cam file into your tracks. So the readme text right over here says copy cameras x.any to any track you want to use the app on so you will usually go into content tracks choose your track data and put in this file from track cam and let's say rename it to camera 8 because it's the corresponding next number. If I had only 4 cameras, rename it to camera 5. But you don't actually have to do this and I can prove it. Let's say I go to Drift Playground 2021. So I click it, data, as you can see there's only the default cameras and I haven't put in this file yet. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to close this and open a set of cores up and then activate my box cam. So Drift Playground 2021, OK, and then I'm going to launch it and let's wait for it to launch. As you can see, it launched. And now I can go into apps, stereo box cam, activate. And look at this. It is activated and it's not blurry. You can change the distance and the height and you're all good. Again, I can open up my files to prove it. Right now, data for Drift Playground 2021, I haven't changed anything. It's still default. And here I haven't changed anything, I haven't dragged it, and it all works. So yeah, it's a pretty easy fix. If this helped you, or if you enjoyed it, make sure to subscribe and leave a comment. And if this didn't help you, make sure to also leave a comment and I will do my best to help you. Thank you for watching and have a great day.